Hi, this is Ryan Oakley, and this is the free online course, Create a Gorgeous Website with Squarespace, a step-by-step -step guide for beginners. This is video 11, and in this video, we're going to be creating our favicon. Okay, now we're ready to create a favicon, and a favicon is the little icon image that shows up in uh, your browser like, like this. So I'm gonna open up the Humans of Nelson uh, page, and you'll see a little camera. Because it's a photography project, a little icon of a camera is a nice little favicon. So let's go ahead and make that because right now it's this default Squarespace block and we can change it really easily. In fact, it's one of the neatest things about uh, Squarespace sites. You don't even have to leave Squarespace to make a favicon. So if we go under logo and title and we scroll down, um, we've got this browser icon favicon and you can add a favicon. But we don't have one, so let's make one. So let's use this create a new logo tool that Squarespace has and it opens up this new little fancy thing and we can give it a name. We can call it favicon and use the little arrow to go over there. This is pretty sweet. Um, so there's a little wizard of how to search for symbols. So let's just search for camera and there's text we could use. There's symbols that we could use. There's all sorts of different things. Um, let's go ahead and delete um, some of the stuff that's already in here. Let's see if I just hit the delete button on those, then they're gone. And so here's the camera. You can pick whatever camera you want. I think I ended up picking something um, that would show up well when it's really small. So here's my favicon image. And you can change the, the color of the image if you want. Um, but I'm going to leave it like that and just because it's pretty simple. Um, and just save it. And what you want to do is you want to save it as this download the high resolution one because the other one will be watermarked. But if you're a customer, uh, you get to do this for free. If you're not a customer, you have to pay 10 bucks for it. Um, so hopefully you've used my coupon code by now and, and signed up for your uh, Squarespace site. And so you're able to download this for free. So I'm an existing Squarespace customer. So I'm going to go ahead and type in my information here. And click download for free. And it's going to go through that. It gives me all sorts of options to download. I'm going to download the color. Um, because I believe what happens is this background becomes transparent. You want a transparent background so that this doesn't become just a white block. So I'm going to go ahead and download this left one here. And then it shows up um, in my browser underneath. Let me just see if I can show you that. So there the download showed up right there. So I can click on that, find out where it is, or see what it is. There it is. Okay, so now I'm going to go back into my site and go to add favicon. And it's going to be under downloads for me. And there's my logo. I'm going to click on it. And it's just going to process and resize. And there it is. Uh, sometimes we'll hit save. Sometimes the, the favicon loads right away and sometimes it takes a while. You can see something's working up there. Um, maybe if we do a refresh, it'll show up. Yeah, it's probably still processing. I, I don't know. It, I remember with my with other favicons I've used, it's taken a while for it to load in. Uh, you might want to try opening a different browser and seeing if it works in there. Um, we can also just do a quick check to see that it did upload. So it's there. I, I have a feeling it's just going to take some time before it shows up on your site. It did for my... Um, my active humans and Nelson site anyways. So anyways, that's how we created a favicon. And in the next video, just going to show you a couple of um, search engine optimization things to do on your on your page to make it show up in Google and and show up when it's linked out to other places like Facebook, make sure it looks good. All right, that's it. We'll see you in the next video.